Hey there, this is Elke here. Today I did a drawing, a cartoon drawing, uh, based off of a request that I got off of my Facebook page, Lori Elke's Art. Uh, I, this came from a boy who I believe is in kindergarten this year, and he said he really wanted a picture of a school bus. So, so sad that the kids can't be in school right now and be using the school buses. Uh, but fun that we could actually draw a school bus. So I went ahead and did a step-by-step -step cartoon drawing of a school bus for him. So hopefully you guys enjoy trying to draw a school bus similar to this one. All right, this is a fun little cartoon one. And as you can see, I added some fun little people in the school bus. You could make it longer if you wanted to add more people. Uh, you can make it less cartoony too if you want. It's up to you. But uh, yeah, I had fun doing this. Thanks so much for the request. And if you have a request of something that you would like me to draw, please feel free to let me know on my Facebook page, Lori Elke's Art. All right, uh, please subscribe below if you're enjoying our videos and can't wait to hear if you have any requests of things that you would like us to draw or paint. All right, have an awesome day and happy drawing. So I am going to start my bus with some wheels and I like to trace my wheels usually so that my circles are better. So I have a cup and I'm going to go ahead and just use this cup, it's actually filled with salt right now, um, to trace my wheels for my bus so that they actually look like nice circles. If you just want to freehand your circles though, you can do that as well. So there's my first one. I'm going to go ahead and leave some space and do my second one by just tracing my cup. All right, and next I'm going to go ahead and draw another circle inside of each of my circles for the inside of the wheels. I'm gonna go ahead and give the wheels some little hubcaps. So this is kind of gonna be more of a cartoony looking bus, but it should be fun. So I'm gonna just make a little line on the side of each of the wheels like that. And then you can connect it with another line that goes around the same shape as the wheels. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and connect the wheels together so that I make the bottom middle part of the bus. So I'm using just a straight line to go across. And then I'm going to put the same, um, at the same level of that line, just a, a real little line in the back and a line in the front of the bus. Okay. Now, next I'm going to give the bus some bumpers. So in the back, I'm going to just do a little, kind of like a little square that hangs onto the back of the bus. Uh, the front I'm going to make a little bit bigger because we're going to see a little bit more, so that'll be a little bit longer, more like a, a rectangle. All right, I'm going to go ahead and focus on the front. I'm going to add a, another line that curves around from the bumper and then goes to the bottom of, or the top of the wheel. And this is where the light is going to be for the bus, so I'm going to add a light. And then I'm going to do one more curved line that's going to start at the edge of the bumper and it's going to go up and it's also going to curve up and I'm going to have that one stop right about there. So about halfway um, uh, along this line right here. And I'm going to add a little grate to the front. So I'm going to draw a line right here and then bring that down and draw some horizontal lines across to show the front part of the bus. All right, now is the important part, which is making the, the main area of the bus. I'm gonna start right here, and I'm gonna make my line nice and tall. So it's gonna go pretty high up, and then across the top here, and then down the back to the top of the bumper. I'm going to leave a little bit hanging out in the back. And I can go ahead and throw on a little light on the back part of the bus. All right, 
Next, of course, we need windows. So I'm gonna go ahead and make the driver's window first. And then I'm going to make a couple of the kid windows in the back. Now I'm making these rather large. It's kind of more of a cartoon bus. So I'm, my goal is not to be super realistic, but this is just more of kind of a fun painting or drawing. Um, school buses usually have a stop sign on the side, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that right here. And to do that, I'm gonna make a line on the top and the bottom of where I want the stop sign to be. And then I'm gonna make a line on the to both sides like that. And I'm gonna use diagonal lines to connect those like that to make an octagon. And I'll go ahead and write stop in there, S, T, O, P. All capital letters usually. Next, I'm gonna make a line that starts kind of along the bottom of the stop sign and it's gonna go all the way across the bus to the very back. And then I'm gonna do the same thing a little bit higher up. So it's gonna start right here and it's gonna run into the stop sign and then go all the way to the back. And if you want to, you can write the word school bus on the side because a lot of them usually have lettering on them. So I'm gonna go ahead and write school bus just in case you weren't sure what it was. And now of course we need um, some of the details like the people inside and I'm gonna put a couple lights on the top here by making these little triangular type shapes with a little light and maybe a little rear view mirror too so that the bus driver can see uh, what's going on behind them. And we need a bus driver, so I'll go ahead and make a cute little hat like this by starting with a diagonal line and then adding a little hat to the top. We'll make a head with two eyes and a mouth and then a little nose and ears. And then he can have a little uniform on here and of course the steering wheel so you can put hands on the steering wheel because he's driving the bus next of course we need some children so you can really have fun with this and make the children however you look i'll probably just start with a couple circles for the heads and you can decide if they're going to be boys or girls so the boys can just have a couple hairs on the top give them some eyes and a smile and then a little body here there's a boy um, if i wanted to do a girl maybe i would give her um, some bangs and then maybe some longer hair in the back give her a little body too and then maybe we'll do one more in the back here we can have maybe some hair like this and a little body. And there you have it. I have a cute little school bus with a driver and kids all ready to go to school. So the next step of course would be to add some fun colors to this and really get creative with uh, decorations. Maybe you could even add a background of where the school bus is. All right, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial.